Well, I mean, it was pretty obvious we've been averaging about 60,000 kilometers a year. And the last probably few months, I could almost tell you what date it was going to be. Just on my two to three hundred kilometers a day that I drive. So yeah, July 30th, 2019, I was coming through Drayton Valley and I knew that it was going to roll. I thought it was going to roll, let's say, because it didn't roll. So yeah, I was driving along and I pulled off to the side of the highway and pulled over onto the side road and, and uh, slowed everything down and I made it, got my camera out and I was going to let it roll. 9999, nine, and then uh, so I got that picture and then pushed ahead to see if it would go over to a million and, and it didn't. <laughs> so that was weird, right? Like, so uh, yeah, so that was July 30th. 2019. I started buying vehicles here, I think, in the 90s, instead of motors when they were downtown. <clears throat> Excuse me, and um, so I got to know, you know, some of the original owners, managers, service managers, parts people, and so on. And and you just get familiar with people, and you know, we, you know, it's always friendly. And hey, Doug, I see you're back, and gee whiz, you must have been out in the mud somewhere, and. So anyway, there's that family kind of thing, I guess, where, and I'm not from Drayton Valley. I live an hour west of, or east of here, towards Stony Plain, but I work out here and I have for 25 years. And, and it just felt like this is where I should deal. And, um, and, and I heard lots of good stories about this membership and sets of owners as well, right? So, so yeah, I think um, really it's all about a relationship and, and, <laughs> Yeah, they've been super with me, right? I can phone up anytime, and <clears throat> the mechanics are great, the technicians, um, service service writers, you know, I can tell them who I am and explain what I think the problem might be and or they can help me through it all over the phone until we can get it in. And, and uh, yeah, no, I, I've got nothing but great things to say about uh, this dealership, Stetson Motors. Unless I get in a wreck with it, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be driving it till, till I can't drive anymore. It's really that simple because I've looked after it. Um, you know, it's had we've got service records to support you know all the work, and um, yeah, I just can't see unless it rots right to the ground. Like I probably won't put a frame underneath it, but you never know. You know what I mean? <laughs> because no, I mean it's been it's been a good truck, right? Um, yeah, I. But if I had to, <laughs> I guess if I had to get rid of it um, because it just fell apart too much, yeah, it'd be, you know, it's like a little kid, right? I mean, it, um, it's been part of my work, my, you know, my last 18 years of work as well, right? So it comes, it takes me to work and brings me home from work. So, um, yeah, I, so, yeah, it'd be pleasure craft after this. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. <laughs> I've got new trucks at home too, right? A couple new ones. and and uh, But this has been the oil-filled truck, so it's, it's seen some pretty tough days on there. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I think if you just look after them and are willing to willing to look after them and fix what needs to be fixed, you can, anybody can do this. It's not magic. <laughs>